Hey there everybody and welcome to the Dragon Age Wiki. Today I'm going to be talking about the Mystical Fade. Now the Fade is a metaphysical realm that is part of Theodus, yet separated by the Veil. The Fade is split up into fiefs belonging to the spirits that live there, and um, they change the landscape of the Fade to evaluate what they see in the minds of their mortal dreamers. According to the Chantry, the Fade is the first realm created by the Maker, which he populated with spirits, the first of his creations. Every living being, with the, exp with the exception of dwarves of course, enter the Fade mentally when they dream, and may just tap into it when they cast spells. Most people don't remember um, their time in the Fade, mages however are forced to recall. Killing a mortal dreaming in the Fade is a shock to their living bodies, but not lethal. Um, the person merely wakes up. Mortals have entered um, the Fade physically only once, which caused the first blight. Now, mages of the circle frequently visit the Fade in with the aid of Lyrium, and during their harrowing, a mage is projected into the Fade to resist the attack of a demon. Now, unlike other living beings, um, dwarves are not connected to the Fade and do not naturally enter it when they dream. Whether this grants them their natural resistance to magic or is a result of, or is a result of, is unclear. But um, certain conditions, a dwarf can be forced into the Fade in a dream state. Now there is one constant feature in the Fade, the Black City, which according to the Chantry was once the Golden City, until the Tevinter Magisters set foot within it. No one has yet found a way to reach it, though if one looks into the sky they can see the Black City, forever in the distance. Now the Chantry also holds that when a person dies, their spirit passes through the Fade into the afterlife. Those who have turned away from the Maker are doomed to wander the Fade forever as lost souls. Now there are several rules in the Fade, and um, these include enemies killed in the Fade do not have loot, however in Awakening enemies may drop ethereal points, potions to be used in the Fade. They cannot bring goods back from the Fade, and even if you learn the Fade shapeshifting, you cannot use it in the normal world. Rangers cannot summon animals while in the Fade, and this seems to not hold true in the um, Fade as is experienced in Awakening. Here a Ranger may freely summon pets. Mages cannot use the spell Animate Dead, and Reavers cannot use the talent Devour to recover health while in the Fade. Items from inventory destroyed while in the Fade will be gone forever, or for that matter, potions used. Attribute and stack gains will remain um, the same in the normal world. Knowledge gained, e.g. codex entries, will remain, and every point in the Fade is equidistant from the Black City. So that's all I have to say on the Fade, um, stay tuned, and um, until next time, Goodbye.